My name is Taryn, and I'm a Native American. I'm also a grass dancer. That goes to two big powwows every summer, up in Fort Washakie and just here in Fort Duchesne. I just started out when I was just a baby. One of my sisters made me an outfit. It was a white color cloth with ribbons, the color of maroon, red, orange, and purple, and blue with some turquoise. I was about two years old when this was made for me. My first powwow took place up at Totskoll Elementary. I think my mom worked there. But anyways, my older cousin went to school there. My mom told me she was showing me off to her friends, so I guess I was kind of cute back then. Later on, I started to dance at 4th of July powwow, except I would run around chasing girls. I was still a toddler in preschool, so I didn't know what I was doing. A year later, I had a new regalia, a purple, turquoise, and white. I started to be more serious about my culture, so I watched the older grass dancers from outside the circle, even though I would dance behind them during in the tribal. Then one of my grandmas passed away, so I cut my hair to where it was only spiky, and I laid off dancing for a year. During the 4th of July powwow, I came back into the circle, besides my uncle Bart. I even had another outfit made. It was made by this lady up in Idaho. It was blue with orange, green, and many other colors. My sister Ona ended up in the hospital because of her kidney failure. There was a powwow going on at the time, so I danced, and when I danced, I kept my sister in my heart with me. After that, she got through her sickness and out of the hospital. The only problem was, she still had to go to dialysis. So I still danced with her at the 4th of July powwow, the powwow down in Ignacio, and up in Fort Washkie. Fort Washkie is where I go every summer to see my grandpa. My grandpa would always tell me stories. When I was 14, my grandpa came for the 4th of July powwow. He told me a new way to dance. He told me, you hold these ribbons and carry them in each hand and sway like the grass and move with your ribbons. So I took this new old-fashioned style of dancing about for a couple of years until he passed, so I cut my hair two inches. And I'm not dancing for another year, and next year I will carry on for my loved ones.